Huh? What, what, can you show them and just like, let's get a close up and then I'll be right back. Um. <laughs> well, let's see if we can get it. Let's see. So there. And let's see. Let's get the pink one out. I can't hear. Your mic is muted. I can't hear you, Habib. What is there we go. happening <laughs> from vacation? <laughs> Streaming live. What's going on, everybody? How's it going, Trace? Good. I thought I was going to get, because uh, I could see you guys in the little box, and I just saw Theo, and I'm like. Yeah, that he was going to. me and Theo gonna, today. No. I had to run to the restroom. That's the truth. <laughs> of course, of course. Of course you did. Sorry, right, I had to go. And he was counting. I'm like, Theo, count down for me. So he was like, 10, 9. It's like rushing over That's here. That's funny. Ramon's like, Theo's counting down. You could tell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was, he was totally doing... counting down for me. Um, <laughs> so I asked him. I was like, hey, we're going to go live. We're going to go live on, uh, on Twitch. I'm like, do you want to go to the beach or do you want to hang with me for a little bit? He was like, I want to hang with you. I was like, okay, cool. Um, so here we are. That's awesome. And I want to say hi to everybody in the chat. Uh, Janine Cherry, Elizabeth Prakash from Fiji. Wow. Citicles created by Cooper. Girl, I love your nails. Mellow. Melly Mellow 7. What's going on? Straight into pink. How's it going? Um Trace, we got a question here from Simply Jessica. I have a few okay. questions I've been needing to get answered. Can I use Flex Synergy Gel as a stain resistant top coat or as gloss gel? Will it give me the stain resistant to non porous qualities that gloss does? Interesting. Yes, okay. but you won't have the shine right. as gloss or stain resistant because it, it's a builder. So, um, yes to the, uh, the non-porous part, uh, as far as shine. <laughs> exactly. The, as far as shine, that's what you're going to get. Can you, tell, can you tell that this is, this is like me, little mini. It's your child. It's your child. <laughs> okay. Okay. Got it. So, uh, basically no, you cannot, right? If you want shine, no. Yeah, yeah, and of course we want, we want shine. Uh, Simply yeah. Jessica, can I mix Builder Flex with Clear Sculptor to thin out the formula? Hundred percent. Yep. Mix, okay. match, do whatever you want. There you go. <laughs> Sees a little bit of laughter there. Um, uh, the Witcher. I know, right, Habib? Why, honey? <laughs> yeah, man, it's uh. It's a oh, little purple BTS lotion basket. What is up, lotion basket crew? Lotion, you know, I dropped a um, when we uh, we did the vlog on Saturday, and for, it was funny because I threw in a little lotion basket on the vlog. I had to. Oh, I missed it. I missed it. Oh. I was at the show. I didn't even watch it. Did you really? Was, oh yeah, I fully was spazzing out on the uh, the new product launch sale, and then had to drop a little lotion basket in there. It well, was funny. People were like, lotion basket! <laughs> I forget. I thought I took a picture. Hold on. I got to find this. One of our uh, people that follow us. Yeah. I had my glasses on to do this. So we hit 1,000 followers. Yes. Thank you, guys. So, yes. Thank Amazing. you. Incredible. So, um, so about that. she posted this on her story. Oh, you yeah. You see the dog, the basket, <laughs> yeah. and the hose. <laughs> and the water's on your head. I saw that. I think that was Strini the Pink, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I think it was Evie. 
Yeah, I, is that is that? I think that's the same person. Same on, per oh, it is. Ramon's giving the thumbs up. Yeah, yeah, I think it's the same person. Um, so so good, so good. Yeah, totally. Um, this is our Lego that we've been building. So we're we're in like project mode here. Um, Let me see. What yes. you got, TT? I'm his assistant. This is his um, uh, Iron Man. We're building an Iron Man Lego that my mom brought for the kids. And he's taken over. I'm the assistant. So I'm the parts finder. So I have to like ah. coordinate and separate the parts. And and he builds. TT, uh, is he doing a good job? Am I doing good, yeah. bro? Am I doing good? Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing good. So, so. <laughs> <laughs> How was the show, Trace? You went to the first nail show that you've been to in ages. You went to the Las Vegas, right? IBS Las Vegas, was it? Uh, yeah, I went just for the day. Yeah, jump. Uh, it was good. It was fun to actually walk walk a show. I haven't done that in ages. It was small, but yeah. um, it was fun. It was good to see people and yeah. hang out and get to see some talented nail artists. And yeah, it was enjoyable. That's cool, man. I know. Yeah. I know that the shows are going to probably start out smaller right now. They of course. Will get, yeah, they'll get to that next, that next level. Um, hopefully by like next year. It's interesting out here in. Uh, in oh, there he is. Let's see that, bro. Let me who's see him. That? That's and that. Uh, who's this, Theo? Um, it's not Tony. Oh, it's not Tony. Oh, this is Tony. Is it Superman? Tony. Oh my gosh, Tracy. I I, I did that on purpose. <laughs> Listen, we're, we're trying we're to get, get a rile out of the, Theo today. Out of, well, out of R Ramon should be shaking his head right about now. Like this is like in the spirit of, of video games and Star Wars and Avengers and all of that. This just goes right in line with it all. Okay. Nice. I, thank you, Ramon. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I said it on purpose. I like messing. Look, I love I'm Ramon's like, look it, of disappointment. Is it Supergirl? Is it <laughs> Wonder no, Woman? Wonder Dog. Seriously, I'm going to see the entire studio get flipped upside down <laughs> right now over Ramon's complete well, utter disappointment. And if Jorge's watching, then I'm in I'm in double trouble. Yeah, you're in double trouble. Knocking, knocking down the door in about two seconds. What is he? <laughs> what is he on? TT? What is that? Theo, yeah, what is that? That thing shoots. I was drinking coffee this morning, and he built this. And literally, from across the table, he fires it. That thing launches. Hardcore. <laughs> it almost went into my coffee, which would have been amazing. Um, I think we have a couple questions here. Okay. Ooh, dude, that's that's crazy. It goes, it seriously goes like ten feet. It's insane. Uh, Simply Jessica, wait. I know I came in strong with bombarding with questions, but can you sandwich mission control between either synergy gels or acrylic? Absolutely. I I sandwich everything. Polish, gel polish, mission control. Ham and cheese. Ham and cheese, of course. Yeah, if you could put it in a nail, I'm going to do it. Uh, so Rose, yes. Vini, when are you coming back to Reno? That's a good question. I don't know when we're going to do um, – I'm thinking probably in 2023. Yeah. 2022. Sorry. 2022. Wow, man. Next That's year. Crazy. Yeah, 2022, I think. Maybe. We'll see. But it's interesting out here – you know, Hawaii is like extremely strict with, yeah. um, you know, with everything, but they, as we, you know, when we just got here, they just loosened up some of the restrictions of like, as long as you're outside, you know, you don't have to no wear a mask, masks. no masks before it was, it was masks everywhere. Still some of the signage around the hotels, like wear a mask whether they're outside, but the staff was like, no, no, when you're outside, you don't have to. Um, oh, so even like if you were at the pool or something, you'd have to wear it before. Uh, I think like, prior to like, I think just recently they changed that. But yeah, I think it was. So you get like that full mask hand, which I was hoping Greg would get, which, which by the way, it, it might, there might be funny cause we're going to take pictures. So like, like Greg's family's here. I'm here. My mom's here. We're going to take some pictures while we're out here. And um, we were talking about last night. We're like, Oh my God, Greg and I are going to go play golf tomorrow. I haven't played golf in like 80 years. We're going to go play. And, and they're like, Oh my God, you guys are going to come back with like the hardcore hat tans and then we're going to take family pictures after. <laughs> we're going to have both have the sunglasses tan, like, and take, Just try to take family pictures. A little makeup, a little concealer. You'll be fine. Well, I, we were like, just Photoshop. They can, they can, they can do it. You know, As my husband says, that's all lies. Yes. 
And whenever I send them pictures, he's all, is that a filter? That's all lies. <laughs> like, You're like, yeah, it is. Yeah. That's what I told him. And <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, what frostbite Ruthie. So, you know, you're going to end up with a bunch of sister hers bands and partners just off things right this wedding is going to be old <laughs> that's hilarious that's it. funny uh sweetie the pink where's greg greg is that way i see him right in now. the water hopefully yeah i think he's at the beach i told him i said hey bro i'm gonna stream i'll head over there afterwards yeah. fix it in post exactly thanks C's. that's exactly what we're gonna do we're gonna fix it in post our, our, our golf tan lines. Golf tan. Um, CS nails. Do you have to wear a mask on the golf course? No. Oh. No. As long as we're outside, uh, which obviously it is. No, I don't think so. I recently bought the Synergy Gel trial kit. And I'm a little confused what the difference between the Synergy Gel clear sculptor and the Synergy Gel build. I noticed they're both clear. Can I try to answer this? Please Trace, do. If I'm right. They're just different consistencies, right? So it's kind of a preference as to what you want to work with, a thicker gel. But I know clear sculpture is great because you can do, oops, you can do like, <laughs> you can do like two, two or three nails at a time, or maybe all of them, and you don't have to like flash cure. Yeah. With yeah. build, you would have to, right? Yeah. So typically, I use clear sculpture for um, extensions because I can do all five fingers. Um, versus using like a base or a build to do it, which are, is going to run. Um, and then sometimes I like to encapsulate in it, but usually I use clear sculptor for extending, build for encapsulating. Yeah. And I know, um, uh, let's see here. Where did she say? Someone said that they were kind of confused by all the options. There's a lot of options, but the, if you break down our gel system like this, base, builder, and finishing, it actually makes it a lot easier to understand. So like we have our base, there's only one, and then we have our builder gels. And within the builder gels, um, there's different consistencies, right? So like flex is thinner, you've got uh, your your build which and build pink, which is a little bit more, and then you have your concealers, which are also a little bit different consistency, but have opacity. Yep. And then obviously clear sculpture is the thickest one in that spectrum. Yep. And then you've got your finishing. So you've got your, you can use gloss or you can use uh, ultimate finish or you can use stain resistant. Am I right, Jace? Yeah. I even separate into four, which is base, builder, white. And, oh, white, well, right. I forgot white. Sorry. And then um, our toppers. And so basically when it comes to builders, it's all about color and how you like to work, viscosity wise. So yeah. it's, it's all about how, however you want to work. You, it, there's no wrong way of doing it. Yeah, totally. There's no wrong way of tickling either. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I know. Wait, like, does this bother you? I, I, switched, I switched it up for you since it's wait, the what afternoon. Is that, Grace? What are you drinking? This is sparkling wild berry. It's so good. Celsius. It has, uh, it's for energy, metabolism, burning body fat, no artificial, no calorie. It's it's good. Good. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Zero cal. Yep. Is it, is it sweet? Mm -hmm. Is it as sweet as me? <coughs> Theo, am I sweet? Wait, come here. I'm sorry. I kind of threw up in my mouth on that yeah, one. <laughs> am I sweet? Yeah. <laughs> See? Theo, That's why are you lying? Sweet. Why are you lying? That's all the validation I need. Tank, you got a question. <laughs> What's the trick with white builder? Hold on. I'm going to give me two seconds while you answer that, Trace. Okay, um, so so white uh, sculpture is what we have, or we have like uh, paint on white, like Mission Control Fizz white. So white sculpture is, it's very pigmented. So it's not something, whenever you're doing white, I always recommend doing a clear base uh, and then doing your white and then encap, you don't have to encapsulate on top of the white, but um, why you want to extend with the white first then remove the form before you do the white sculpture is because the white is so pigmented, it, the light is going to have a hard time penetrating it. And then especially if you have a form down, it's trying to penetrate through the form and the white sculpture. <gasps> hey, Meals, how are you? <laughs> you having I'm fun? Good. Yeah. How are you? Very cool. Very cool. But that's uh, the difference between the white sculptor and uh, a builder. So... 
Mills? Are you building? Were you? I thought she was at the beach too. No, she's hanging oh, out. I guess she's just hanging out. Yeah. One thing I want to say. Um, <laughs> notice her pajamas. Okay. Yeah, well, obviously the best. So they're lemon they, pajamas. They're like lemon pajamas. Yeah, right? I like it. I them on a special trip I went to for my graduation. Yeah, and Theo and I had s'mores pajamas. So last night we had a pajama battle. It was me and Theo in s'mores pajamas. And it was Mavet and Mila and Lennon. And we were just like talking smack to each other. I'm like, yo, s'mores pajamas. It's like, no, lemon pajamas. I'm like, no, screw you, man. This is, this is it. We were just kind of going off, right? Yeah. I saw your picture for Father's Day of uh, all of you in the, yeah. uh, the s'mores pajamas. That was so cute. Yeah. So cute. We all have one except for. Except, mom. yeah, of course. She, she get gets them. them. I know. I know. Now we have to have a poll. So, hey, uh, uh, Trace, Tank said, Tank Jackson said they lifted after a few days. Did you already address that? Uh, oh, his white lifted? Did you yeah. do what I just explained, T Tank? Um, and you don't want to add white on top of white either. So once you do the white, leave it alone. You can touch it up a little bit. But again, when you do multiple layers of white, you're going to have a hard time penetrating. So that might be why. Let Got me know. It. Yeah. Got it. Um, so Trace, I need help understanding how to clean my brushes I use for hard gel, not acrylic. Can I answer this? Yes. I love this. I don't have to do anything. I'm going to sit here and have my drink and be good. Can we just do this? <laughs> you know what? Why aren't you wearing your pajamas? That would have been perfect. I know. I know. Because I went and worked out with Greg at like 7 a.m. on the lawn. There's a, there's with like, no tennis shoes. Yeah, I didn't have to. I forgot my tennis shoes. So Greg's like, he's like, no shoes, no problem. He's like, here's, you can see the bottom of the. There's the s'mores. That's awesome. Um, so he called me out there and we did some insane, some insane workout, like barefoot on, there's a huge lawn out there. So it was actually great. So that's why I had a chance. If I, can you imagine, maybe, you know what? Maybe tomorrow I'll show up in my s'mores pajamas Do it. in the lawn Do and it. just freak everybody I out. Just, I could just see everybody on their balcony. Honey, come here. <laughs> And Greg has to wear Mavette's lemonade once. What's that? And then Greg has to wear Mavette's lemonade pajamas. Yeah, yeah, I think that's great. I think that would be good. Um, but that's why I don't have mine on there. Um, but uh, yeah, I came back in here. It's weird that it's it's three hours behind. Yeah, here. You guys are it's just weird. I'm used to I'm I'm used to LA being the earliest because we yeah. go to like. Chicago, it's two hours. We go to New York, it's three hours ahead. We go to you know Europe, it's always like seven plus hours ahead. This is weird. Like it really kind of threw me off being three hours earlier. Like, like we were we were we were exhausted at like eight last night. We were like, oh my gosh, it's like eleven. So it's because you're old. This yes, is true. It is. <laughs> <laughs> well, Ramon this morning was all, hey, did that jerk text and say if we're doing Twitch? And I'm like, geez, Ramon, that's your boss. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I can totally picture Ramon saying that. <laughs> Ramon, and then I looked it up. I'm like, oh, it's five. It's five a.m. there, so he hasn't text. Ramon, can I get a look of disappointment, please? Just give me one, please. Head. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that's our look of disappointment from Ramon. Oh my god. Okay, from uh, Jad along three hundred. Um, how do you guys? Well, you, you didn't answer the question. What was the question? On hard gel, how to clean. Oh my gosh, sorry, how to clean hard gel from, so you use, you use gel, you wanna get some gel, put it out like on a tile, right? You can, yeah, it depends. Like, are we trying to clean color out of the brush or are we just trying to clean our brush to put it away? Yeah, kind actually, of thing. Um, you know, why don't you take this one? Cause I don't wanna mess it up. <laughs> so if it's, if it's a, if it's, hold on, let me grab. And by the way, thank you. Thank you, Simply Jessica. Let's not say old. It's triggering. Yes. Thank you. Although, I want to I want to mention I'm this. I'm older, so I can say old. <laughs> this morning, I, I talked to, uh, I called Tracy, and because I dropped, <laughs> I dropped my dogs off at Tracy's house on Sunday. And Tracy was in Vegas at the show. So I dropped Wilbur and Sugar Puff at, um, uh, to Stan, Tracy's husband. He was home. So- uh, dropped them off. Dogs love going to, to Auntie Tracy's because they just get spoiled as they do at home. Sugar so Puff it, actually swims and has the motivation to walk. 
Yeah, he does. He actually has the motivation to walk. Sometimes he goes upstairs, which he never does at our house. Um, but uh, Tracy's like, oh, Stan, Stan uh, said, like, the, this is the best compliment ever. He's like, Habib, what did he say, Trace? Why don't you say it for everybody? Go ahead. Let him know. He said, Habib looks like crap. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's funny because I couldn't remember who said it. I thought like yeah. someone at the show said it. And then I'm like, oh my gosh, it was Stan. No, he's like, oh my gosh, Habib looks so young and so like he really like, oh I'm like, oh God, I don't want to hear this. I just don't want to hear it. Like it's disappointing. <laughs> I threatened it's divorce. No. Dude, dude, that is the best compliment I could ever get. So I, I love your Wait, husband. Hold hand movements out of here. No. Oh yeah, I was Ew. I was I was streaming with Mila the other day. What did I say, honey? I was yeah, like, you we you me. I, he was playing Fortnite with me, Theo, my friend, and him, and he said the cringiest ass thing ever, and I was just disappointed. Okay, let's chill on the language. Number one, <laughs> number two, number two. I called her dog. I was like, yo, what's up, dog? And she's like, oh my god, dad, Go please, away. please do not ever ever say that. Um, hold Showing on your age on that one. I know, I know. He, by knows, he, he, he was actually made to, I mean, this is a job of all parents. I did it for my son. He's going to do it for you. It is our job to embarrass you. <laughs> exactly. <Sigh>. Okay, so <laughs> cleaning the gel like, brush. Oh, sorry. We're still on that one. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> so you're going to take your gel brush. If it's just like putting it away for the day and you don't have any color, you just take a lint-free wipe. Just wipe off any excess, or you can wipe it off in your jar. I like to keep mine kind of moisturized or moist with a little gel, and then I just roll it to a point just very, very lightly, and I put it away. But I keep gel in my gel brush. Okay, we got we got the answer. You can move on, Habib. Okay, okay good. No, I'm just, everybody <laughs> in here is like, LMAO at ass. Habib's smile faded real quick. <laughs> Listen, honey, you're live. You got to chill in the language. Um, let's see here. <laughs> Baskets on fire, exactly. <laughs> this is the longest roundabout way to answer a question. Somebody, Jessica, it completely. I know. Is. This is what happens when I stream on. I was supposed to be on uh, vacation, but I just, I was, I was texting Caesar this morning, and I'm like, mm -hmm. hey, I think we're gonna go live on Twitch, and he's like, dude, you should be on vacation. I'm like, I'm on vacation. We can stream for an hour. You know what I mean? It's why not? It's not a big deal. Um, and he was like, that'll be cool. That'll be amazing. So wait, simply Jessica, Habib looks great. I can't help but hate and I'm just 30, but I feel like I just left high school. <laughs> Thank you. See, huge compliment. Uh, created by Let's Cooper. Oh, stop that. When using full color nails from the Insta studio, should they be filed before painting them? Uh, I would recommend it. I would recommend if you're just polishing, I, I still like to buff them just to give them a little grit. And then if you're doing gel polish or anything on them, you want to take a, like a medium grit file to it first. That's what I would have said. <clears throat> uh, Tracy and I are on the same page on this. Oh, <laughs> uh, I love that created by Cooper. When you love work so much, it's not like work. Yeah. yeah that That's the thing. Yeah, buddy. Oh, wow. Nice. Oh my gosh, those launch. He just launched two things past me. Um, yeah. No, it's true, actually. Like, that's the thing. You know, like, I don't, th especially this, this never feels like work. Um, it just doesn't, right? I wouldn't know what to do with myself if I wasn't working even on my days off. I know, I know, I know. It's, it's, uh, same. Uh, etching underside of full color can help adhesion. Mama Frog 7. Well, what was the question? Etching, no, she's just making a comment. Etching the underside of a full cover can help with adhesion. Oh, underside, yes. If you're, if you're, uh, especially if you're uh, doing like a gel to connect them, yes, definitely. Simply, Jessica, man, I wish you guys did daily Twitch streams, but I get it. Life gets in the way. Listen, we're we're working, we're, we're working on at least going Monday through Friday. You know what I'm saying? Like doing five days a week. I think is very, very realistic and possible, especially with this setup now, which, with um, the ability to where I can stream, like uh, if, if I'm at home and I can stream from home and just uh, check in with Trace and Ramon and be like, yo, let's go. So kind of like we're doing right now. Yep. Um, so it's coming really soon. 
Okay, let me read the most important comment oh. in the entire, the entire chat. This is really important, guys. I don't have my glasses on, so th this will be interesting. Lisa Garcia, thank you. Habib is handsome. Mm -hmm. Tracy's beautiful gal as well. Look at this. Thank Love the kiddos. You. They will learn to behave. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I, we will never learn how to behave, though. Actually, this, this is the problem. This is the problem. Um, okay. C. Winrausch, can you tell us about the sale that starts tomorrow, or do we have to wait? It doesn't start tomorrow. Thursday. Tuesday. Yeah, okay. I was like, what day is it? It starts Thursday night, 9 p.m. Pacific Standard. So um, we usually put out a little map with the time zones so that you know when, when the sale starts for you. Yep. Um, okay, Jada Long 300, how do you guys recommend removing gel polish from toenails? Trace? I like to electrophile them off. It's quick, it's easy, fast, best way, I yeah. think. Genesis, Celeste, are they able to see our questions? Yes, I can see all of your questions, actually. Did you have a question from before, Genesis? I want to make sure I didn't miss it. If you did, if you have a question, please drop it in the chat and we will get to it. It may take two hours for us to answer it, but right, we'll yeah. get to it. <laughs> Because like somebody commented, we go here and then we go there. And then we go. <laughs> so we some, but we get to it eventually. Uh, Casey Busseri, I have a quick question. Would I be able to use one of my brushes from a poly gel kit for the Synergy gel? You know, I don't know. I I, I have to be honest because I'm not familiar with the brushes that comes in it. But you can typically use a Kalinsky or a synthetic to apply gel. So I would say yes. I mean. I used to, before we came out with the precision gel applicators, use the back of the brush to apply gel. So I would say, yeah. And that that's why the precision applicators have been so great for us is because uh, Tracy was kind of showing, I remember when she was showing that, she doesn't actually use the brush, she's the back of a brush. And that's why precision gel is, 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 it is, it is easier. I mean, when I've done yeah. it, you know, it has, it's still, I mean, obviously for me as a beginner, it's still hard, but I can at least get a little bit of a hang of it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Amy Facker, if a new client has water damage under the nail, do you take it off or just uh, keep Bill in? Tracy, I'll be right back. Sorry, I have to do this. I'm like running around while people are here, but answer it's that fine. question. It's fine. Um, question, and I'll be right back. So, okay. Amy, what I would ask is like, is it, are you talking like that you got some greenies going on? That kind of water damage or just that that some water got underneath it if if there's water or any type of water uh like you need to remove the nail probably and start over um because you want to make sure that there's no air pockets or moisture trapped or anything like that so usually i would recommend that you remove it and reapply it if it's lifted and there's water underneath but yeah what do we got um wow never seen a live like this before <laughs> Yeah, yeah, but please help. I do my own nails using free forms and acrylic. After a couple of days, they lift. Why and how do I stop it? Okay, so I would say that typically when we have lifting, it uh, it's a um, a prep issue. So uh, hit us up, DM, DM us, or you can email me direct. Um, give me your steps of how you prep, and I'll walk through it with you and see if that's the problem. Um, but 99% of the time, it's a prep issue. Uh, Ramon, you just put something else up. I just saw it. but I just answered that. Oh, you did? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. uh, from Genesis, how often should we replace our e-files? I'm saving up to buy your e-file, and I'm so excited. Um, you shouldn't have to. Like, yeah. It should last you many years, so it would be a long time before I would replace the only time I replace it is every time a young nails came out with a new one, which annoyed me because the old one was just fine, but I had to have the new one. Um, so yeah, if you get a good electrophile and I know they're very expensive, but if you get a, a workhorse is what I call them. Like they just keep giving and giving and they don't uh, bog down or lose power. You should be able to keep them for years and years and years. Yeah. As long as you, you, you like okay. maintenance, clean, maintain. maintenance, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You maintain it, make sure it's clean. That thing, that thing, that thing should last forever. Just keeps giving, yeah. Uh, Skitcraft 2, not a question, but I used Star Sand on my most recent set on my right hand, and it's so pretty. I need more glitters now. Thanks for making quality products. Star Sand is one of my favorite. I love the bloom. It's, it's yeah. so beautiful. 
That is a uh, beautiful one. Yeah, uh, thanks, Ramon, for posting the uh, the pre-4th of July sale. The Times starts Thursday the 24th, 9 p.m., and it goes until Monday midnight. Um, yeah. yeah, and we, we got to, what, 15? 15 deals. 15, yeah, and there's some really strong, deals. strong deals in there. So um, if you need nail liquid, this is going to be a good time. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. Yeah, I didn't say that, right, Theo? Yeah, definitely. Definitely didn't say that. I didn't even say yeah. <laughs> you know, he's like, yeah, you definitely didn't say that, Dad. Yeah, uh huh. Uh huh. Definitely, right? Yes. Jackie uh, 009, I'm having trouble with acrylic flowers. Any advice? What trouble are you having, number one? But, um, Trace, any advice on those? Um. This is more of a great question because he loves yeah. doing flowers. I hate doing flowers with a passion. Um, but I actually like my powder to set up much faster when I'm doing flowers. This is not something you would typically do if you're doing for strength. But when I'm doing flowers, I actually dip my brush in a little acetone and then dip it into the liquid to, because it speeds up my powder. Um, again, do not do that for full sets. For flowers, it's going to make it set up because I have zero patience for uh because you need it to firm up right when you're molding the flower and that's going to make it set up and firm up right away so you can push it out so that that's very helpful to me because i have lack of patience <laughs> um you know it's interesting you see lack of patience but it's for you it's a it's a that's a most times that would be looked at negatively but it when you say it, what you actually mean is you like to be really efficient yes. in this lawn. So like not having a lot of patience for wasting time. time. Yeah. yeah. And that's why if you are doing 3D work, you you got to be charging for that. Yeah, because exactly. it's not about, you know, because you can do a flower in one color, right, Habib? So people are like, oh, you yeah. say you use $5 for a color. No, no, no. Not when doing flowers on all the nails. It's $5 per flower yeah. at least. Yeah, because you're, I mean. It's, it's technique. It's yeah. time. That detail of like you got to flatten the petal and then go back yeah. in and flatten another petal. And again, again, and then, you you know, I've seen Greg do it. Um, I've seen the tutorials as well. Uh, and, and you should, you should look up like, you know, flower nail art, young nails. Yeah. And he does. We'll have a ton of videos does. on that. He does some beautiful work on it. Um, created by Cooper. What does I R K mean? It's actually I K R. I know, right. Is what it stands for. So, um, I think, I hope I'm not old and didn't get that right. I'm pretty oh. sure that's what it means. Ramonski says yes. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> uh, camera of how do I maintain an e-file? Good question. Actually. What does that mean, Tracy? How would you maintain an e-file? Well, it, so the first thing I say about maintaining the e-file is, uh, dusting it constantly after e each service and, and keeping stuff off of it. I, there's some e-files to me, but I, I've been in a salon where I'm just like, I wouldn't touch the thing. Like it's, it's just right? Kate with yeah. it. Yeah. Bad. And then you can also send them in to be cleaned. So, um, to maintain them. So, because inside the, the, um, chuck area where you put, slide the bit, it can start getting packed full of dust. Right. There are other things that you can buy that will help maintain it. The, there is a, I'm forgetting what they're called, but they actually slide over the, uh, uh so you have the, the shaft part of the bit, it slides over that. So dust doesn't get down into the chuck. So those are really great to actually, so to prevent it from happening. But um, it's just keeping them clean is mostly it and not not being gross. Yeah. Um, let's see here. Sorry, let me just go up. Uh, grungy grunge bought another UV LED lamp on Friday had a client come in. Polish kept peeling. Client noticed only six bulbs were working. Is that, is that our? Did you that ours, or was that somebody else's? If it's ours, we need to get that. Call. Yeah, we'll fix it right call. away. We'll, we'll we'll replace it right away. Yeah, instantly. Um, Frostbite Ruthie, I just did my dominant hand for the first time. Z kind of enhancement. I used forms and hard gel and everything. From Tracy and Greg's videos, a wild ride. Nice. Well, I hope, Very cool. I hope, yeah, that's awesome. That's a great um, 
path to to go on. Uh, I feel like I need my glasses on. I'm having a hard time seeing. The chat? Yeah. Let's see. Coffee and corgis. Drop of acetone and dampen dish in with the monomer. So that, that can help speed. If you're doing flowers, can that help speed up the setting time? Yes, that's exactly what I did. I mean, you can you can dip in both too. I just, uh, or you can just put a very little because that's going to set it up so fast if you put a lot in there. Um, yeah. And again, this is not a strength thing. You do not want to do that for a full set, but for yeah. um, for speeding up those flowers, try it. You're going to love it. Simply Jessica, what are your actual neon products? The swatches online are so inaccurate. No offense. Which acrylic and gels are actually bright neons? Yeah, so uh, just to address the online, it is really hard. So, mm -hmm. so what happens is it depends on your computer, your monitor, your settings. Like, um, it can't. It's it's it, it's a challenge to get it like super super like perfect in terms of color. Obviously, in person is ideal, but uh, we're still always trying to work on that update. Um, yeah. but we're, and we're actually going through all of them and right redoing now. them and yeah. on yeah. actual finger. But again, I, I, I mean, we've seen it where I've, I've called my mom. I'm like, this color isn't right. He's all, it's your computer. <laughs> you yeah. have, you, your, your settings are off. So yeah, right. but, um, we are working, trying to get them more yeah. and more accurate, but it is a challenge. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and what are our actual neon products? What kind of neons do we have? Uh, we have neon slip pores. That's right, and it's like, yeah. what, what colors would some of those be, Trace? Uh, Venus Rising, uh, we have uh, Canary Yellow. Uh, you're putting me on the spot. Uh, <laughs> well, we have, I don't think we have for you. Can you make that color? Put me on huh? the spot? <laughs> dad dad jokes, dad so, bad. Dad. so bad, so bad. basket. <laughs> Uh, I did not think there was any comparison. Why it hands down. Thank you. Created by Cooper. Really mm -hmm. appreciate that. That's very nice. Um, let's see here. Oh, and we do have some neon, uh, gel polishes. We have neon yellow, neon pink, a couple different ones. Yeah. Yeah. Um, absolutely. What do you what see, Trey? I actually just sent a YN an email through contact us messenger about dust getting dust under the top on and off of the control box. I'm confused. Uh, I actually just sent YN an email through the contact us messenger about dust getting dust under the, so you have gotten it under the control box? Is that what I'm getting, Ramon? You see that, right? that coffee and corgis? There it is. So I want an email through the contact messenger, but about dust getting dust under the top on off button of the control box hmm. of the e-file. Yeah. I'm, I'm, that's what I'm assuming that she's talking about. Um, dust on top on the, the box isn't a problem, but you, I recommend dusting it off all the time uh, because it does get very dusty. Uh, but it, I mean, the electric file is made to obviously get uh, uh, dust on there. Shouldn't that shouldn't be a problem, but maintain it and keep it clean in between. Yeah. Hey, did our challenge video, did that launch yet? Or is that launching next week? Do we know? I don't, I don't think it's launched yet. Okay. Cause oh uh, skit, skit craft too. Can we get more challenge videos a month? Absolutely love them. Uh, I know we're, we do one a month right now. Yeah. Maybe we can do more. Wait until you see this month. <laughs> Tracy does a nail blindfolded, blindfolded. And I try to guide her and it's, and he was Tracy not very helpful. Oh my God. It, I was awful. That's the truth. We don't know. It's not up yet. Ramon's telling me. Okay. But okay. Yeah, no. It should be next week. I think it's next week. But Will yeah. you bring back the airbrush system? Probably not in the near future. Probably um, not, but I, I sure love airbrushing. Yeah, so much easier to do your ombres and stuff. So much easier. But you never uh, know. Yeah, exactly. Cassie yeah. Baseri, it'd be cool if you guys did a swatch video of your acrylics a week. And we actually have some swatch videos. Mm -hmm. If you type in SWAT on YouTube, swatch young nails, we do have some of like the acrylics and the gels, and we do have some swatch videos. You can check it out. Um, no question. About oh, you passed your state board. Congratulations, Savannah. Nice. That's 92%. awesome. 92%. Wow. Nice. I don't think I could do that now. <laughs> 
I might fail. That's really, that is really good. Uh, challenge videos are so great. Thank you. We that was our our, our marketing team's um, idea of doing these challenge videos, and we're going to try to get more in there. <laughs> this is like every minute of the day, by the way. Mm -hmm. I mean, why are you awesome. skipping my question? I'm not. Mellow, Melly Mellow Seven. Where is it? Let me see here. Can you find? Did oh, you miss it? Are you showing the new item close up? What item? Oh, the 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 confettis, the party oh, sure. party party can poppers. Huh? Well, well, can you show them and just like let's get a close up and then I'll be right back. Um. <laughs> Let's see if we can get it. Let's see. So there. And let's see. Let's get the pink one out. And that. And uh oh. Oh, there it is. Oh, I have the old color stuck to my fingers. Okay. And then we have. And that. You know, there, there's, there will be a close up picture of from online too, right, Ramon? Yeah. 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 So those are them. Let's see. If apply hard gel over acrylic, can they be soaked off if you break the seal or filed off? So you're going to have to go through the gel um, before you can start soaking it off uh, because the gel is going to kind of seal everything in. It might eventually start breaking down if it can kind of get underneath, but it's best just to file it down as far as you can and then do the soaking off. Cool. Um, yes. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, there's, um, I, uh, yeah, just on comments on, uh, we're all family here. We are all family here. And like, this is, you know, I'm like that right there. Hello. Hello. <laughs> um, and this right here. <laughs> oh, <geez>. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's either like stream with a foot in my face or no stream. And I pick stream with the foot in my face. I think stream with the foot in my face is actually somewhat entertaining. Um, how often should we send our e-files to be cleaned, Trace? I recommend like, uh, we, most companies are gonna tell you once a year. Uh, I didn't, I did mine about once every two years. Uh, it just depends how much dust you're getting on them. Um, but once every other year, I would say, yeah. Tracy, what? I do have OCD. Let's see, Tracy, I do have OCD, so I totally uh, leaned into your advice to let go and just get the product on there instead of getting it perfect because you say it again and again, and I know I'll drive myself over the edge otherwise because OCD, maybe leaned in too hard. I will post on IG and tag you, uh, pick a beginning and finish comparison. Tracy, what do you think about that? I love it because um, I also um, get the same way, and it was very hard for me to let go. Uh, and, uh, it, it caused me a lot of anxiety and stress, but if you keep it up, I promise the end result is just as good, if not better. And I love that you're doing it. So yes, please, please tag me. I want to see it. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you too. Um, sorry, before we get to Kelly's, uh, that idea and concept does not just apply mm -hmm. to nails, but this idea of perfection, like building a business like if you get rep, people that are going to really struggle in building a business is if you're like, Oh, everything needs to be, I, I used to try to get everything perfect. And I used to so stressed out, man. And, yeah. And, 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 and it things. prevents things from getting done. You can't get anything done because you, you never want to get done. started because you're like, it's going to take me forever to get it perfect. So you just don't do it. Yeah. It's about making small improvements over time. It's totally about, uh, progress, not, perfection. You, you cannot think that way in, in just building your outside of the, there's the nail portion and then there's the building the business part. You can't or else yeah. you'll, be, you'll really be in trouble. Drive yourself uh, crazy. You will drive yourself absolutely nuts. Yeah. I mean, now you should see there's things that happen in our business and, and Trace and I talk about them. It's like, okay, did we make a small improvement or did we, did we learn anything from this? And, and then 
on we go. We just keep yeah. moving forward. Kelly nailed it. Where do we send the e-file to be cleaned? So um, if you've purchased from us, just contact us. If it's an older e-file that you've gotten from us, we'll be able to get you in the right direction. And um, if it's one of ours, uh, the, you know, we can help you get that in to get cleaned. So you just have to contact us. And what's the most important features in buying a nail trail trace? Like what would you look at? So a lot of people will tell you how fast it goes, which most e-files are gonna go 30,000 RPMs. Um, for me, the most important features is something I call, uh, or we call cruise control. So it's when you put it to the nail, does it bog down? Does it keep its speed? Um, I liken it to like, if we're driving down uh, the highway, we're going 90 because I like to go 90. And if we hit a hill and I'm in cruise control, my car knows oh, I want to keep that. Yeah. And that's what it's going to keep doing. It's the same with a good electric file. It goes, okay, you want to go 13,000 RPMs and you put it to the nail, it will keep its 13,000 RPMs where a lot of electric files will slow way down. So people kick the speed up way up to try to make up for that. And that's when you can get like rings of fire or bogging down can cause heat, things like that. So that for me is the most important feature is that it keeps its speed when you put it to the nail. Chanel Franco, what else will be on sale? Oh, you're going to have to just wait two days, Chanel, and see. But I can tell you there's some good stuff. Um, what numbers do you look at for this? I'm not sure I understand. Do you know where going? The e-file? E yeah, continuation of the e-file question. Okay. Uh, oh. you, well, I mean, mo mo typically uh, e-files will all say zero to 30,000 RPMs is uh, – is that what we're talking about, Ramon? Like the RPMs? Yeah, so most of them will say that, and most do kick up to 30,000 RPMs. It's, does it keep, first of all, you're never gonna get there. The highest I ever get is about 16,000 RPMs, and that's for cutting and smile lines. But again, that's because I have an electric file that when I put it to the nail, it doesn't slow way down. Um, so uh, most of them are gonna say that. Uh, and yes, Kelly, uh, the torque and the RPMs is kind of all one and the same for me. That's what means when you put it to the nail, it keeps that constant speed. Tammy S, thank you, Tracy. I started doing nails after watching your videos and now I'm starting my own business. Thank you so much. Oh, YNS, that's Ooh, awesome. you guys rock. That's, congrats yeah. to you, Tammy S, seriously. That's awesome, congratulations. And uh, we're gonna give you a Spock salute right here, <laughs> alien salute for Fortnite for me and Theo. Congrats to you, that is honestly amazing. Tasha yes. Elk. Hi from South Dakota, wanting to start doing nails, but would online classes be a good start or room one? Or maybe oh, like, a, like, a, a, like in person? In person, yeah. Here's the great thing. If you can't get an online class or in-person class right now, you got all this YouTube that's completely free. Start, yeah. just start. If you can do um, Zoom, that's great. In in person classes are amazing too because if you have a, an educator or a mentor that's going to walk around and help you, um, that's that's uh, you know that's why the, our OWCs our, our one week courses are so powerful. Is you have a minimum of three instructors that are walking around, sitting down with you, watching what you're doing. So that is, I mean, that is the top, the best of the best is if you can be in person. But if you can't, online, YouTube. They're all wonderful too. Yeah, there's some links that were put up uh, over some of the conversation. Um, I think C's put up a link for, um, he dropped a link, Ramon's dropping links. So uh, yeah. really there, there's so many great videos online that you can tap into to, to get started. A lotion basket salute. Serena oh, true. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, simply <laughs> Jessica Trace, she said her, so just to sum it up, her license had lapsed. Okay. Is there the best way for brushing up on theory and practical part of state board? I need to get my license reinstated and I can't remember due to. Are you <laughs> in Kelly? She's in, uh, you live in Cali. She lives in Jersey trying okay. to reinstate into Philly. Sorry. Okay. Uh, but how would you even brush up on theory in general? I think there's a there's things that you can find online personally, and there are a lot of schools will offer 
just that part of their courses. Now, here in California, you can let your license expire. I believe it's five years and not have to do any of that. So you might look into that. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, but you might just hit up your local school and see if there is a way that they have that part of the course that you can take. Um, and I've seen things online. So I would just uh, do some research there, too. Is stain resistant considered a hard gel? Yeah. Tracy? Yes. Okay. I consider it a hard gel. Yeah. Okay. So because it's non-porous, okay. it's, it's not going to break down. So yeah, it's a hard that's, gel. And that's 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 really the line if it's porous or non-porous, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like a lot of gel polishes are porous, hard gels non-porous. Yeah, totally. Correct. Uh, Daylene Medina, I also love how you guys make videos to help us grow. It's so helpful and also love your products uh, so much. High quality. Thank you very much. That Thank means you. a lot to us. That That's huge. Um, price ranges for in-person wine classes when they, when they start again, I think they're in person. Are they a hundred dollars for the one day? I believe the one days are a hundred. Yeah. hundred. And then our OWC, which is a five day. It's like is nine fifty nine seventy five something like that. It's, yeah, I think it's nine fifty something like that. <laughs> uh, bless you. We should know that, but it's been so it's been it's a while. Been a long time. I know the the one yeah. days might be one fifty. I don't I don't remember. I don't um, remember. Ray, you can email Ray at youngnails.com and he'll get you the info. But I know the OWC. It's a five day, super intense live. I mean, those were nine twenty five per person. Um, you know, hopefully yeah. we'll bring that back next year. Yeah, hopefully next year for sure. Kelly nailed it to get the Milady book. Um, so maybe you want to look at that. Yep. Uh, also, Habibi said that social media is backward. You do it and get better, but you have to start instead of being paralyzed by trying to be perfect. Yes. Um, just click for me. I decided to do it. I was too afraid before. I'm starting one post every one or two days this last week. Actually, on my stagnant IG account, I will increase. Yes. So it's the same thing. It's like social media is backwards in, in terms of like how marketing is these days. Like you have to put out a lot of content reps on social media to start to dial it in, to yeah. start to write it and, and make it, make it better. In the beginning, everyone, when you do it initially, um, you, you're learning. You're in a learning phase. So you can't be afraid. You got to put it out. And here's the one thing I always say is that people, people never, you know, when people go through Instagram or TikTok, think how fast you scroll. When you come across a post that is just, you know, like regular, maybe, maybe it's not hidden, but it's not awful. Nobody stops, goes, oh my God, this post is so mediocre, you know, and then move on. If it's people stop when it's either, you know, eye catching. Um, and that could be for shock factor, shock value, or something educational that they want to learn. But if a post, it, you know, nobody stops and just goes, oh, that post is so middle of the road. <laughs> nobody cares. And I think that's what people get 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 caught up on is that they just keep scrolling. Yeah. You know? And that's the thing, right? We say it doesn't really matter what you post, but it does matter if you post. That's so huge. That's a great yeah. quote. Tracy Ryerson, great quote. Um, it doesn't, it doesn't, and you will, you will develop it with time. with time. That's what we did. You know, I always tell people also, like when we start first started doing TikTok, um, we, we had no traction. We were putting out two posts a day, you know, one post a day initially, two posts and nothing. And then after four months of posting two posts a day, um, we finally found something where it got, it was like, Ooh, you know, and it was an acrylic flowing down the nail yep. and we were like, satisfying. Oh, yeah, satisfying. We're like, that's what we have to do. But we never would have found that out if we didn't post for four months and tried everything. We tried education. We tried some comedy. We tried this, that none of it worked. Fail, 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 worked. Fail, worked. Exactly. I don't, Kelly now that I also encourage her to look up their state laws on the state website. That's really good. It should be there yeah. or in Oregon, the license requirement was, was three part, very practical and uh and state law so um absolutely that's always a good thing to do 100 percent um social media class to like 12 2 p.m shameless plug it's not a shameless plug it's a solid plug we do have one if you guys are interested it's a three-hour course i'll be going through so much information to really up your game 
I share everything that we do at Young Nails, everything that we do. There's nothing, there's no secrets. I don't hold anything back, any questions that you have. I share exactly what we do and how we do it in detail. Um, so if you guys want to join me, it's it's a really good class. And then also what we do is we have you guys put up your um, your Instagram accounts and we go through your Instagram and I can help point out some improvements to, to, to get it, you know, to get it going. What I can tell you though, is the biggest thing that people are constantly not doing is posting. It's amazing how rare it is that I open somebody's account and they post daily. It's very rare. So, um, that's the first thing that, that you need to do. Uh, Oh, I forgot you about forgot? Lucy. You forgot? Shower. How could you forget? you forget <laughs> how could you forget it will yn sell any chrome pigment we have in the past and we might we might do it again yeah i mean i i love a good chrome we kind of come out with some new ones maybe yeah i'm good. down let's do it uh kathy tarman you you all at yn are so helpful for everyone you make me smile and laugh all the time that's awesome we all need that thank you so much you're all an inspiration thank you Thank you. We Thank you, Kathy. we try to edu you know obviously number one point is to educate and help you, but in the process of doing that, we like to have fun and we like to be us and be ourselves and hopefully um, hopefully that helps. Um, okay, guys, I'm gonna wrap this up today. Theo, are we wrapping it up? <laughs> you gonna go swimming, Theo? We're gonna head down there and go meet my brother. I'm gonna punch him in the face when I see him, and nice. Theo's gonna, Theo's gonna. Get a choke on him. A nice, uh, exactly, right? You're going to choke Uncle Greg out? Yeah. Yeah, he's going to choke <laughs> Uncle Greg out. <laughs> We're going to head down okay. there. But uh, let's see. Tomorrow I cannot, but maybe Thursday and Friday we can stream. And I'll try to get okay. up a little earlier because I know this time is a little off, but maybe we'll get up earlier. Regardless, we'll stream a couple more times this week. I know you you, you cut into my lunch. I haven't eaten all day because of oh you. Oh, my gosh. That makes me happy, actually. <laughs> We're gonna do, here we go. Rear naked. Rear naked. Chip. Tap. Uh, tap out. out. Tap. I have to, if he if he does not stop, I will pass out. I have to tap. <laughs> uh, you guys have an amazing, amazing day, and um, we'll be back in a, in a couple days. And thank you guys for hanging with us today on such short notice. See you soon. Bye. Bye, guys. Say bye to you. Bye. And thumbs bye. up. And wave again. And thumbs up. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching these highlights from our Twitch stream to talk to us live on Twitch. Join us Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday mornings. Come hang with us. We love engaging with you and talking with you in the chat. It's at Young Nails Inc. on Twitch.